What's up guys? Um, welcome to new video. Today I will tell you how you save your hands from GG Poker into your Poker Tracker. So I'm using Holder Manager 3. And this will be just quick explaining how you will save your hands into your Poker Tracker. So what you're gonna do is open GG Poker, click on PokerCraft as I did. So one more time. I already opened uh, two poker crafts, so this is how it looks, pretty easy, huge loss obviously, and yeah, um, now just open this, and today I played session, um, I played hold'em session, I played NL200, 200? 200? NL200, only four tables, A quickly morning session, I won on every table, but as you can see, it was on the 300 hands, I won 800 bucks, but oh, I, I, I was a bit lucky, I guess, one buy in over EV, that's great, huh? I don't even remember when, when was the luck, hmm. but whatever, so what you're gonna do is download this, now it will look like this, um, then you will create some kind of folder as I'm gonna show you GG poker hands here's my old poker hands so what can you do is either have it like this um, so this is my last session this like since summer it's around 100 and all so you can do this like you will open this open this file I don't even know how to explain it a zip file yeah it's zip file so you can open this zip file like this, you have it, obviously ne no one buys the full version, and you can do this, just select and copy, where is the copy, uh, copy files to clipboard I guess, and now you can do this, um, you will just create new file here, and you will set date for example, Today is Christmas, so Merry Christmas everyone, and, I'm, and actually I'm having a names day, so yeah. So you open this file and insert the, insert the hands. This is the one way you can do it, and <clears throat> also there is, there is another way, the first one I was talking about, um, I'll just quickly find the, what I download, the zip file. So download its files and again we have it here. What we can do, we can we can just put it here, rename it whatever you want. Um, doesn't matter, you just can remember it. You will put it here and now you have the file. Okay, so we have it saved. We know where it's saved. Now basically uh, the problem here is you don't have any stats here on PokerCraft. It's only showing um, that you won a hundred, but obviously GG is not showing how much is it without rakeback, so it can be pretty misleading from time to time. So what you're gonna do is just open your pocket tracker. Uh, you've seen not the best sessions I had less lately. And either you will click here and click on op import folder. This is the first variant that I showed you, so we can do that. It will show you something like this function requires that you stop auto import, but auto import doesn't even work for uh, GG Poker. So, would you like stop auto import and continue? Obviously, want to stop that and continue uh, because it's it doesn't even it doesn't even work for GG. So don't be scared of, about that. Um, and now I will find GG Poker hands. It's here. I have a lot of a lot of hands here. And now I can only download this file, so I click here and I choose choose this file. And you see the session is here. And they took 75 bucks from our rake. Um, basically, I played one hour and 15 minutes. I won a really big, and rake was 55 bucks. Uh, big blind slash 100 was 950 
So this is why you want to keep track of your of your hands in the poker track. Then you can like uh, uh, just check some hands you played, for example. Um, you know, this is the biggest hand I played. So you can just study the hands. It's really good to have them saved. Uh, the poker tracker is not showing the names. Uh, for hands from GG it will not show the hands. So even max player names, yeah, it will show the names like this. So don't be scared. It's totally fine. It's how GG just works. So yeah, um, this is my biggest hand. Check, check. See you bet. And I bet he jammed, I called, and he had queens for some reason. So yeah, that's GG poker for you. Um, the other variant is what you can do. Um, to import it like this, so you will import files. That's the other variant, and basically you will import this. So you just click and it will import. I already have this imported, so obviously nothing will show. But yeah, you got the point, guys. Huh? What else? That's everything, guys. Um, I hope, because someone was asking the question, and I figured a lot of people actually don't even save their hands, don't study. So just do it. Um, at least keep track of your hands, of your real winnings, of how much rake you're paying, how much rake back you got. Um, this is just easy way to explain how to import your hands from GG Poker. So hopefully at least some of you will, it will help and thanks for watching and go check out my stream sometimes or anything. Thanks for watching. Bye guys. And Merry Christmas, obviously.